and we saw a man called Garukandi. Eh! Mutawan Wabitaro. He had a piki piki. I think he was an assistant agricultural officer. Say, he's from Makere. And he has got a, a diploma. Oh, 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 we were really impressed. But when I came into government, even before I came into government, I knew those people who had done BSC agriculture. At that time, during the time of the colonial people, it seems, I don't know, you can, come, you can study it, it seems they were teaching our people very well how to do, to grow, to grow crops, how to put them in line, how to use improved seeds, how to do this, good agricultural practices. But value addition, it seems, it was not being talked about. When you produce, I know this because from my guerrilla side, I came to know to know more about value addition than even some of our people, the scientists. For instance, when I went to Namulonge, where they were telling me about cotton, 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 they were saying cotton, you can get textiles from cotton. You can get uh, cooking oil from cotton seeds. You can also get animal feeds from cotton, uh, cotton seed cake. Mm -hmm. I waited. They didn't. They stopped there. I said, do you know that you can get gunpowder, that they get gunpowder from cotton? And these people seemed not to know. They didn't know why the Chinese were buying so much cotton from here, taking it. They would go and make uh, gunpowder, nitrocellulose, and sell it to us here who are asleep. And, and because of that, you find our military industries are not as efficient as the Chinese ones. Because we are using imported gunpowder, nitrocellulose, to pack it here. Our only job is to pack it. So I was telling you, why don't you produce? We are the ones with the cotton. So the, these science courses, they must be integrated, teaching how to look for material, as the professor was saying, Professor Nawang was saying, how they can look for the, for the minerals, but we should have the technology to look for the minerals, but to add value to, add value to all of them up to the last, so that we get value from them. our knowledge about nature from the science side. Now, from this, this is now natural sciences, but from the science side of social science, it is again the same challenge. Because this human being, this homo sapiens sapien, when he was inventing things, and that it would affect the way society is organized. You have seen that when, when fire was invented, the whole society changed from staying in trees to staying in caves. When, we invent, when our people, ancient people invented agriculture, the whole thing changed. In the hunter-gathering -gather, times, the, the, the hunter was very important because he, he, he could, he's the one who was feeding the family. But now, with the crops, the one who could cultivate, 
was more became very important, and who could domesticate uh, animals. So every change in the level of science affects the society. Now, are we conversant with these social ideas? Because these are now social ideas now. Uh, I came here and I spoke to Pro Professor Chirumira. He was the one heading the history uh, department. And I wanted to engage them because I was already very active with the science side. The food technology people, I was with them. Chiam uh, Florence Muranga, and all of those were always the, the Chira Motors, Sasizi, Tokodri. The, I'm always very busy with those to deepen the ideas of natural science. How about the social science side? Because there are a lot of problems there. The, par the paralysis in Africa is because of those of that side of, of, the, of the social sciences. The correct ideas of how to organize society. So I therefore challenge you and I challenge Dr. Kionga to, to, to audit this. How is that? When we came from the, the, the bush, I, I brought these ideas. And I met Dr. Mujaju. We came, I talked with Dr. Mujaju, we talked. I thought he had got what I was saying. Introducing political economy as a paper, the paper in all courses, whatever you study, have a paper to understand the laws that govern the changes in society, which are these, these laws. I'm telling you that law number one is that when there's ch change in science and technology, there are concomitant changes in society. It's what I'm telling you now. And this is what I wanted Mujaju to, to follow up. But then Mujaju went and, and made development studies. Before I knew, that, that you could get a degree in development studies. It was a whole degree now. Eh? But me, I was talking about a paper in political economy, not, not, not uh, how is the development studies from, uh, where, where do you put economics, where do you put what? I, I couldn't. Uh -huh. Up to now, I have not had time really to go back for, for that battle. So when I went to our university in Barra, which I had started, because in Barra I, I started it myself, and I wanted it to follow my, our, our NRM ideas, I, I put the focus of medicine. Then with Professor Kayanja, we added a focus to computer science, no, science education, to teach science teachers. Then we added, I think, Bachelor of Nursing, and Bachelor of Computer, something. Then I had they had certain development studies. Ah, please, please. Please, 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 please. I don't know what, I, 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 I protested. I didn't go on the streets, but I don't know whether it is still there in, in, in Barara or what. Uh, so, With these few words, I con con regarding the road unit, that's a very good idea. A road unit for I would definitely support that to, so that you can have your own road unit. You teach your your engineers how to make roads and how to build build to do buildings and so on. Practically, I totally agree with that. Coming to talk to the students, I will be very happy. Oh, I like talking. If you invite me, 
If you invite me, you do so at your own risk. So I will happy to come. But I think we are moving very well because since we introduced the research fund, you have seen what has been achieved. The banana project of Dr. Muranga, the projects of Professor Chamanje, the Kira Motors, the vaccines, things are really moving. Uh, the the, the anti-tick vaccine of Dr. Kahwa and uh, Naro, they have, they have invented uh, an anti-tick vaccine where you can kill the, where the cow can kill the ticks. So the ticks are now endangered species instead of endangering the cow. So we are moving very well. I just want us to refine that. All these graduates of agriculture, you must not only grow the crops, but to know how to use them to the, final, to the last gram. Because what's happening in the world is a scandal. I have given you 